right, if they don't pick up, I'm going to go the next person. All right, I'll go the next. Wait, I have somebody. All right, this person said they've been waiting all day. Oh, we got it. All right, Trader Nob is their name. So let's see. There you go. All day. I've been waiting all day. You got it, sir. What's going on, brother? How you doing? Merry Christmas. Doing good, man. Thanks for waiting, my friend. Of course. Good things are worth waiting for, you know? Thank you, man. Just, so, I just want to say, man? I want to say uh, thank you, man, for everything that you do. Um, I'm just I'm just super surprised I was able to get on here with you. But uh, I, I started doing a lot of running in 2019, and um, I started having a lot of stress in my legs, and I just had a lot of pain. I've been playing sports my entire life, but an alternative to running, I really got into jump roping. Uh, I, in your jump roping video that you posted the other day, totally motivated me. Um, it just reminded me of why I started. So right. I just want to appreciate you for that, man. And uh, these are my ropes right here, half pound ropes, quarter pound ropes. Uh, I would love to send you some of my videos, bro. It's just, uh, I do it every day. It's my thing. Gets me going. This is my brother, Chris Novielli, right here. Yeah, David Dunn. What's happening, bro? What's up, man? We should just support the kids from California, man. And, uh, you know, we love life, man. Just blessed that God brought us here, man, for people like you uh, to make us better people. You know, you're a leader to us. So we appreciate that. Yeah, we respect. Hey, man, send those videos to info at David Dunn. Let me see that four pound rope shit. That's no joke, son. Well, hey, hey, David, really quick, man. I'm no, not even joking. This kid right here. He's unreal on the roast, man. You got to check him out. But uh, I'll let you go. I know you're busy. You got other callers. But uh, it's good talking to you, bro. Hey, man. Merry Christmas. And stay hard, bro. Merry Christmas to you. You guys stay have long. an incredible Christmas. Thank you. You Dude. too. See you, bro. All right. Much love. Much good love. Night. All right. I'll choose another one. Joel. Joel. Just waiting for just, there you go. How's it going, David? What's going on, Joe? How's my treat, man? I'm good, I'm good. Um, I'm not gonna lie, no, I, you know, I watched your videos for a long time. <clears throat> I never read your book or anything, but uh, I just been trying to change my life, so I wanted to see if you have any like guidance on how to do that, pretty much. Well, you know what, man, for, for me, what happened to me, man, was uh. I had to find out first where the fuck I was going in life. So, you know, a lot of us start to walk down this fucking road of life, and we just start walking aimlessly. And we don't know where the fuck we're going. And that's what I was doing for many years. But until I went to become a Navy SEAL and kind of guided my life, you know, towards some focal point. So, so, so you need a focal point. And once you get your focal point, man, you can start your journey. But right now, you need to be walking. So, whatever your focal point is, man, focus on that and just dive in on that shit. So you're telling me to find a purpose, pretty much. Find a purpose, but you know that's so you know that's kind of fucking played out and washed out. So mine's mine's focal point. Focal point, all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Find a purpose, find what you want to do in life, and then you start walking. So don't just start walking fucking aimlessly. And whenever I want to give up, what do you recommend me doing? <laughs> Look around you. There are a lot of motherfuckers out there who are struggling, and they ain't giving up. So my big thing in life, man, is that if that motherfucker can do it, so can I. All right. Thanks a lot, man. Merry Christmas to you. I really appreciate your time. Hey, man. Stay hard, brother. Take care. Good night. Good night. All right. We'll just do a few more. Do you mind just calling her? Sure, Just so she doesn't keep scratching. All right. We'll just do a few last ones. Okay, should be Matt. There you go. Hey, Matt, what's going on, brother? Hey. So, um, hey, one sec. So, step in a different room here. What's up, man? Hey, how you doing, Matt? Good, big fan. Hey, thank you very much, man. Yeah, I actually, um, oh, shit, I was not expecting this, like, right now at all. <laughs> um, yeah, um, so my uncle's a Navy SEAL, 
and he got me kind of into your stuff. And uh, he's actually overseas right now. He's the commander of SEAL Team 3. Oh, nice. Yeah. And then um, yeah, I commented, too. Um, I went to Iowa for JT's race, 5K. So I'm trying to, like, eat food. Like, you know, uh, he- Hello? You there? Yeah. Okay. I think. Yeah, yeah, we got you. Oh, yeah. Yeah, let's we'll see. Hey, man, well, hey, I just want to wish you a Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, buddy. You stay hard and keep on grinding, bro. Yeah, thanks, Eddie. You meant a lot to me. Thank you so much, man. Yeah, thank you. All right, man. Bye. All right, bye. All right. Here we go. Let me get another couple of people. So people just want to know how I'm choosing people. There's a thousand requests. I'm just picking at random. So there's no order. I'm just trying to just get through and just choose some folks. All right. This is the Hungry Mofo. Hungry Mofo. <laughs> And if they don't answer, I'll go to the next. Oh, yep. Hold on. They just answered. Hello? 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 Yes. Can you hear me? We, we can hear you. Oh, cool. This is sick. Wow. Uh, this is amazing. Uh, Blue Goggins, can you hear me? Yeah, I got you, man. What's going on, bro? Thanks, sick. My Bluetooth is not working. Uh, ever since I found out about you, I've just been on the grind daily. Like, life is not, right now my income is zero. And, like, life's got me down. But, like, every time, you, like, it motivated me. Like, it's it's crazy because, like, I had to take care of this car this summer. And, like, uh, the commute there and the commute back, uh, trying to take my mom there, is almost, like, three hours worth of just listening to David Goggins' motivation. Like, legit, you live inside me. And, like, uh... I want to be, like, up there in terms of business, like, in as an entrepreneur. And, like, uh, right now, I'm, like, pretty much at zero. But, like, I, I need to get become a millionaire and, like, just pushing myself harder every day and getting, like, running in the cold, like, pushing myself in terms of um, just work out, trying to get everything clutch, you know, and getting my morning routine down, evening routine down just so that I can provide for my family and become a breadwinner and achieve my dreams. Man, I love that, man. You know what? Zero is a good spot. If you uh, if you read my book, you'll see that I was at at, at negative zero, negative zero. So, uh, hey, man, if you keep working your fucking ass off, trust me, the tide will turn. Uh, the tide will turn, but you know what happened? Uh, like the first, because basically once I found out about you from Sharan Shavista or something, uh, he recommended that book. Once I found out about you, I just went read your audiobook and everything. And like, um, what I found like I wanted to stay so disciplined, but the thing is like long term consistency. I don't know how to do that yet because I I fell down. Uh, during the holidays, just got a little very sloppy and shit, and like just trying to regain that momentum. Like, how how do you have any advice for that? Yeah, yeah. The advice is stop listening to your soft self. Your soft self is making you fucking stop think about shit. Stop overthinking, man. You're overthinking shit. Just get the shit on. Go out there. Work hard. Work. Whether it's working out, your job, whatever, man. You gotta stop overthinking what's in front of you. If you want to be a, like like a breadwinner for your family. You're not going to do it by allowing your soft self to get involved with your hard self. Okay, uh, so just like drown out that weak inner bitch, pretty much. That is exactly it. Whenever you start feeling like a little weak little bitch, say to yourself, this is not the right feeling, and then still do what you don't want to do. Exactly. And uh, one other question, like I have really real, real bad problem waking up. Like sometimes I oversleep. Do you have any advice to wake yourself up and have discipline? Yeah. It's the same exact advice I gave you about there again, man. Like, okay, man, I'm so stupid this shit. You just have to do it. Like you just have to like, once you realize that, so first of all, right now, my advice to you is this, your goals, 
that you have to do it. While you have goals, you don't really want to achieve them. Because trust me, no one wants to fucking get up. No one wants to do any of this shit. But once that goal becomes bigger than your fucking, I don't want to do it, you realize I have to do it versus I don't want to do it. So once your mind flips to, I just have to do this shit, everything will fall into place, man. But hey, Merry Christmas. Stay hard, brother. Merry Christmas, man. Like, uh, you've really made my Christmas the fact that I got on. I'm, I'm very grateful for everything that you've done for me. Thank you so much, sir. Thanks a man. Talk to you. All right. All right. Now we have over a thousand people requesting to join you. So, let's do the last few ones. Let's keep it up for a second. All right. All right. Claire, Jesse, Charlie. Yes, here you go. You oh my it. gosh. David Goggins. Hey, I just wanted to say um, I did a full Ironman after reading your book and also just watching your videos. I love the one about saying in your mind, don't let them own yours. Yeah, I love everything you do. You said a full Ironman? Yeah, I did a full Ironman. Never done a triathlon before in my life. Uh, but signed up and kept watching your videos and got through it, got second in my age group, um, did it in uh, sub-13 hours. So you try to say that you're a badass, huh? <laughs> Maybe, but I, I get so motivated by your videos. Uh, it makes me add a lot more videos to my stories. Like, I just, you've helped me, like, be more articulate even in how I share with my following, too. So I love that. I fucking love that shit, man. You know, it's hard to go from couch to fucking Iron Man. Yeah. <laughs> so that's fucking mad props to you. Um, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year, and continue kicking the fucking life's ass. I love hearing that shit. Yeah, happy Merry Christmas. Merry fucking Christmas. Thanks, David. <laughs> I love it. Awesome. <laughs> Good, night. Right. Good night. Bye. Bye. All right.